What am I about to show you is probably the best kept secret on Space Smash for a long time and I'm talking about like October, November 2023. I've done a video about increasing posts after publishing ATX and since then I learned a few new things. So, do you want to fill your hard drives until your heart content? Let's see how. So in this example, uh, when I done that video, you can see my notes and you can see the space there. So I got four, two, two, one, one. But now, if you look at my recent space, most of them is 100 SUs. So, looks like increasing posts after publishing ATX, it's possible. But how do we do this? It's really not that hard. The instructions are simple, but the, after that, you need to understand a few things. So please keep watching the video so you don't have many questions. So I'm missing note 4 here, so that's the one I'm going to use for example. So to increase space is like I've done on previous video. So um, if you're using a script, you just go to your script and change the SUs. So you also need to do this on your post data metadata. So the value needs to match. If you're still using this on your config mainnet, it's not necessary to be there, but if you're using, I advise to change that as well. And that's it. All you have to do now is start your note. Now the node will go through the process and it will realize that it's missing space and it will start generating space. Just like this one is doing right now. So node 7 used to be 4 tips or 63 SUs and now it's 110 SUs. How can I do all this in the same system, in one poet? Well, this number here might give you a clue. Are you tired of missing your cycle gap? Would you like to have more post data and earn more rewards? Enter Team24. Team24 is a community run 24 hour poet. What this means is you now have 24 hours to finish your post data reading instead of only 12. Twin24 provides the fastest poets at the moment available and they also have other services like early search cycle gap. The setup is straightforward and easy to do, regardless if you have a new or existing node you can join Team24 now. I'm just going to show you this on a spreadsheet because it's just easier to explain. So imagine you have a 50 SU node and you want to increase that, for example, 100. You need to finish before the next poet, otherwise you will miss a epoch. If you finish the 100 for next poet, then 100 will be registered, but remember, Protocol says you need to own the space for two weeks, at least two weeks. What that means is, this epoch, you still get 50, and then you register for the second epoch at 100, and then you start earning 100. 
So, if you increase before the first poet epoch, you still have the original size, and then after you register the second poet, then you earn the next size. But what, a, what if I have a 50 SU node and I want to increase, for example, 200, but I don't have time to finish before the next poet? In order not to miss an epoch, the trick we can do is, for example, here I put 100, and which means this, the next epoch will be 50, and register 100. So, and I'll start generating here again. So, on the next poet, I'll have 200 which means on the next epoch, I'll have 100, and the next poet, 200, and the next epoch, 200. Was this easy to understand? I don't think so. <laughs> Let me just copy this here. And I'll try to explain again. So you start generating post, but you need to stop whatever you have before the next cycle. So imagine I finish 199, whatever I had time to do. Sometimes things happen. Next epoch, I will have still the next original size. On the next poet, I will register it for 200, which is the size I wanted in the first place. And the next epoch, I'll get 100, which is the first poet I went through. Next poet I will resist the 200 and eventually I get the 200 on the further epoch. And you can do this for how many times you want. And I'm going to show you this example here. So this is a node that register 2.5 tips on epoch 8 and then it started to grow 9.4 for 10 13 on 11, 15 on 12, and it stayed like that. It means it's got a 16 terabyte hard drive. It's probably using 1024 for this. All I'm saying now is uh, the things I said on my previous video about uh, expansion and uh, increasing post after publishing ATX is almost everything wrong. <laughs> Because expansion has been possible for quite some time now, and someone has been doing it since Epoch 9. There was a bug about the nonsense, which is this one, but uh, I think it's been sorted and merged as well. I will leave the link if you want to explore further. This is the part where the, they fixed the VRF nonsense. There was a problem that uh, the nodes couldn't deal with it, which deleting the nonsense uh, fixes for me. And um, the last two nodes I expand didn't have any issues whatsoever, so I think that's been sorted. Anyway, um, I think the increase of network will be ri even more ridiculous now. And uh, yeah, it's a big bomb I'm dropping. My rewards will decrease as well. But we do what we do. <laughs> I hope this video is helpful, guys. Don't forget to subscribe and put a like. And as always, I'm on this Space Mesh Discord channel for questions, help, or just drop me a comment below. And I'll try to answer to the best of my knowledge. I'll see you next time.